Hey guys, how's it going today? Today we're going to be learning how to rescan for Renate B2. First thing you're going to want to do is go into the description and you're going to want to download all the links in there. I'll leave links to all this in there so you can go ahead and download it. So once you get everything downloaded, we're going to first off open up the Renate Converter Suite. We're going to go and open it and you're going to see there's a file in here, an exe. You're going to run that. It's going to go ahead and launch up. You're going to click next and it's already routed to your Renate unless it's in a different location and you want to change it but it should already be there if you have your Renate in a C drive. You're going to click next, next, and then it'll launch the O10 editor. With this, you're just going to go next and install it completely. I've already got it installed on mine, and so I don't really got to continue on that. After this, uh, I do believe you have to restart your computer. I'm not completely sure. It'll tell you at the end. You're going to click finish. All right, so once we've installed that, we're going to go ahead and open up the required tools. And here, we're going to see there's two files in here, a PNG to DDS and a converted output. So, we're going to go ahead and install the uh, PNG to DDS first. So, you're going to click I accept, next, create a desktop shortcut, next, and install. Once you've installed it, you'll get a little shortcut in here, right there. Easy to convert PNG to DDS. Now, we're going to go ahead and go to our Run8 Studios, Run8 V2, and you're going to drag and drop converted output.bat. And I've already got it there, so I'm just going to replace it. Now, after you've done this, we're going to go ahead and scroll down to find we have a new one, a TX8 to PNG converter. This came from the converter suite. So we're going to go ahead and right click it, click copy, go to content, V2 rail vehicles, body, and you're going to paste it in here. Once you paste it in here, you're going to right click it, run as administrator, type one and press enter after you've done that it's going to go through a long process and it could take a couple minutes and so you just got to sit back and wait for it and it'll convert all your tx8s to pngs so once you've done that you're going to go and see that we have a folder called png output this is all of your tx8s to pngs so obviously you can see like the auto racks you can open those up and see that you have the auto racks well once we've already got that we're going to go ahead and launch our editor mine's paint.net and I'm just going to drop any PNG I want to rescan into paint.net and I'm going to click open. At this point you can edit it, do whatever you want to with it, draw on it, doesn't matter. So I've already got my rescan finished right here. 4617. It's a CNO unit. So file, save as, PNG, and I'm going to rename it to whatever I want to replace. Obviously this one's going to replace the SD40 Cargill. So I'm going to click save, OK, and right here to here. It's on my desktop now. So at this point, we're going to run the converter, uh, the easy to convert, drag our PNG onto it, and click this little converter right here. And it'll give it a second and press OK. And this leaves us a little DDS right here. Now we're going to go to our main directory of run 8. At this point, we're going to go ahead and run the converted output.bat. And we're going to open it up and drop our, T our DDS into there. Now, we're going to go to our content, V2 rail vehicles, body, and you're going to find whatever you're rescanning. So, say we just rescanned the Cargill. We're going to look up Cargill, and we're going to want to delete the TX8 in here. Because this, if you already have the TX8 and you've run the converter and stuff, it will not work when you're putting it in the game. So, we're going to go ahead, right click it, and delete it. To make sure it's deleted, you can search it again and see the D uh, the TX8 is no longer here. Only the RN8 here. So, once we've done all that and we've got the DDS inside the converted output, we're going to run the HRS's autorack pack, which will be in the description for a link. We're going to run it, and we're going to open up with this right here. And we're going to click Next, I Accept, Next, and we're going to change the route, scroll down a little bit, and go to your main directory of V2, Run8 Studios, Run8 Transmitter V2, Next, yes, we'd like to replace it and install. Now, we're going to go ahead and run our run 8. We're going to go ahead and hop into a scenario, it doesn't matter which one. And it's going to say V1 rolling stock has been installed and we'd like to convert it automatically to V2. This may take a couple minutes. At this point, you're just going to click OK. And it will pop up a little window where it's converting. Alright, we're in the game. So, 
what we're going to do is we're going to look and see if our reskin got in the game. So we're going to go and find whatever reskin was named. Mine was the cargo unit that I replaced with. So I'm going to go ahead and open it up and put it in the game. And obviously it's there now. We have the CNO unit over the cargo. Uh, hopefully this guy's helped you out. It's uh, pretty much the simplest way there is to convert into Run 8. And uh, have a good day.